new album is coming up real real soon yeah. let's talk about this one last time we spoke we were we were getting ready to release young gods right so let's talk about baptism yeah baptism of thieves is just uh it's done man it'll be out november 24th it's extremely eclectic it's like a whole new vibe that we were exploring like bands like a new order and whatnot so there's some more guitar and a lot of the tracks but then there's still a lot of like the old sound like from SD Kill Wave and then there's still like the vibe from Gothic Summer, Young Gods and then there's like a whole new sound that we are bringing to the forefront of what we're doing. What was creating that sound like when you guys went in to finally start working on this record? It was, ref uh, David doesn't speak, it was refreshing man, you, you know just to be able to like have access to more equipment and like better sound, you know, just better studios and whatnot. Because right. when we were first started, you know, we were doing that out of the pad. Right. So now that, you know, we have the ability and the means to explore new things, especially musically, like frequencies. We were, we've been experimenting with frequencies a lot, actually. And that, and, and those experiments are all in this album, Baptism of Thieves. That's awesome, dude. And you guys released a couple songs already, one of them featuring Kat Von D, yeah. which I had completely forgotten that she can sing as well. Um, tell me about that that process and working with her on this track. Uh, it's like it was a dream, man. I still have to pinch myself over it, man. She's so kind, so generous, and so talented on so many levels. Um, yeah, we you know we linked up, and we you know at first it was actually to collab on a music video uh, outside of Black Leather. It was for a different uh, a song that's not even out yet. It's called Underneath the Stars, which will be in Oraciones, which it'll be our fifth album. So we were working on that track. We actually ended up putting it aside and saving it. But what occurred was to me at the time I was working on Black Leather and I was like, man, I know she has an amazing voice. I know she's an amazing talent. You know, maybe I should I just ask her like, hey, would you be interested in like, you know, working on some music with us outside of music, on working on, on, on music videos? And she agreed. She's all, well, let me listen to the song. I played Black Leather for her. She fell in love. We went to the studio. She knocked it out like, man, under half an hour. Like, she's so good, so good. And next thing you know, we did work on a music video like we were supposed to, but it was for Black Leather instead of for Underneath the Stars. That's amazing, dude. Like, yeah. And going back to that first time we spoke, since then, the hype is still just growing and growing. Yeah, that's crazy, and, right? Yeah, it's that's amazing so crazy. That you guys are doing all this. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's... I don't want to say we're surprised, but you know, yeah, things are just, they continue to move and move at a right. rapid pace. And uh, we're just trying to keep up. Right. And, and lastly, you guys are getting ready for a tour. Can you tell me a little bit about that tour? Yeah, the tour is coming up. You know, it's uh, to promote the new album, Baptism of Thieves. And, um, you know, there's a few dates local. Um, there's a, a Los Angeles show, of course. And I'm um, going to New York soon, too, to play a few things up there. But, um, yeah, the tour, you know, it'll be from November to December.